Uh, my name is Henry Cooper. I'm running for State Representative District 148. Thank you. We have a beautiful representative in that district. It's a Democrat. She's a, she has been for eight terms over there. She's nice with, with people, nice with, with uh, Hispanics and everything. And I've been questioned why I am running against her. She's a Democrat. She's one of us. Well, uh, I was going to run against a Republican, but with the redistricting, I, I uh, went to bed in District 135, and then I wake up, and it was District 148. And I questioned myself, well, really, why should I run against this lady? Well, because at the end, the issues are what is important, not her personality, not what she's been doing with our community, that she has been nice. However, when it is time to stand for jobs, she is willing to support the pipeline that is going to go through these states and doing really bad things that you have already heard. At the end, she is also supporting a sheriff that has deported more uh, undocumented people that are Pio in Arizona, and she has said nothing. Right now, we have three, uh, 3,500 ladies janitors on a strike in Houston, and she has not been present on those rallies. That's why I'm running against this lady. That's why we have to be the alternative. Now, the day before yesterday, I listened in the news that the state of Texas is looking to eliminate 1.4 million of voters that they haven't voted in the last two elections. Hmm, who hasn't voted? Probably someone that sees the same crap every single time. Who elected this lady to her district? Only the 20, only 12% of the electoral of District 148 today elected this lady. Yes. What happened with the 85? Right. What happened? Well, what happened is that all my co-workers, they haven't voted in years because they have no confidence in the politicians. And now it is the time for us to step in and step forward yes. to do and represent the job that our co-workers want. Yes. That's why when you are going to start running on these campaigns, Please, do not focus on the 15% of those persons that are going to vote either Democrat or Republican. They are going to be out there. You have to focus on the 85% of our fellow citizens that have been ignored for decades. That's why, that's why, even though that this is a nice lady, I'm stepping forward in running for my district and, my, and for my fellow workers. And now, do not think that undocumented people are not going to be participants on this election. If you convince my brothers and sisters that have no papers, that you are willing to do something for them, they are going to activate more citizens than any other Democrat or Republican visiting houses. That has happened there, there in Houston. So do not disregard our brothers and sisters from the border. Y además, para todos aquellos que necesiten que traducir sus documentos al español, estoy en la mejor disposición de hacerlo para tener una campaña bilingüe. Estamos en Texas y hablamos dos idiomas, si no es que más. Así es que, por favor, tenemos que estar conscientes de lo que pasa. My name is Henry Cooper, and I'm running for District 148, and I ask you to vote for me. Thank you.